Plant Geek here. Today I want to talk to you about primroses. Now primroses are available in almost every colour of the rainbow. They're really, really gorgeous. But did you know that primroses can bloom for three seasons of the year? They bloom from autumn, through winter, through spring. They only take a rest in the summer. It's absolutely incredible. And today I'm going to talk to you about some new hardy botanical varieties. So first up is Everlast. Now this is a supercharged version of the wild primrose. It has bigger blooms and it has almost 50 blooms at any one time. Long flowering, giving you that three seasons of color and it's still a great nectar source for the bees. Very start is the next generation of cowslip. These have been hybridized with typical primroses to give you giant flowered cowslips with that traditional fragrance and a range of really vibrant and racy colors. Now for something really different, how about the Gold Lace series? Traditionally, this was only available in gold, but now we have silver and many other colors. Now, another tip with your hardy primroses, you can plant them outdoors beneath your perennials. So plant them into the same border, and then the perennials will give the primroses the shade that they need in the summer. And of course the primroses will fill that gap with color the rest of the year. And finally, we have Calibri. Oh yes, traditional polyanthus just have one or two stems. They're varying heights. They're not very weatherproof, but Calibri has short, multi stems and multi heads. It has outstanding weather performance and never looks untidy. Spring comes early when you grow Calibri in your garden. Rudy Race are a breeding company based in Belgium and they have extensive breeding and trials. And they have brought us some of the most fantastic primroses for our gardens. Pretty much most of the primroses that you've probably been buying in the garden center will have come from that breeding stable. But hopefully I've inspired you to look out for a few new varieties.